Hello, welcome to College Chat. I am Angie Cooksey, Director of Admission here at Bradley, and joining me today is Mike Gavick, my co-director of admission at Bradley, um, to talk about one of those big topics in admission, the actual applying to college part. Um, and so Mike, you've worked with a lot of students over the years. What is the thing that you tell them as they, they get started with this whole process? Sure, obviously for however many years it's been now, we've been talking <laughs> about applications, and I think the, the biggest thing is just knowing the timeline and, and doing it. I mean, really, it, it's going to be a big, scary uh, time for you guys, but I think really ultimately once you get started and you start submitting those applications, that's the, the big step one. And um, really, truly doing the, the research up front now or whenever it may be that it's it's just early, you want to get ahead of the, the, the ball or get ahead of the curve there and, and take care of things early on. Um, and we can talk about the, the timeline of it too. Sure. Uh, truly. It, I would say, um, as you guys are starting to enter your senior year, a, a big piece of the puzzle is um, knowing the deadlines. So if your schools that you're mm -hmm. applying to have deadlines, uh, you want to make sure and meet those. But I think ideally, uh, you'll want to probably set a, a good time in September to really truly have all your applications done and submitted to the schools you're planning to apply to. Okay, so let's, let's back up just a little bit. You talked about applications. What are applications? Where can students find them? Are, do students still submit paper applications? Like, where do they start? Yeah, it's it's been a few years since I've seen a, a paper application, but uh, truly, uh, most every application you're you're going to find out there is digital. It's online. Um, many, many, if not all, schools have their own application, so you can go directly to a school's website and, and apply uh, that way. Uh, you also have things like the Common application out there. Uh, I know we are part of that, um, as well as many other schools too. So the Common app, uh, a school's individual app, are probably going to be the main two ways that we see students applying. Uh, there are a few other options out there. I know the Coalition app is a thing, um, but only about 140, 150 schools I think are just getting started with that, but truly I think they'll probably find their way to a school's website to apply or the common application. Okay, and then there's so many schools out there, you mentioned 140 schools are just on that one coalition application. Um, how many schools should a student apply to? Like all of them? One school? Where's that kind of magic number? Is there a magic number? Yeah, the magic number for me was, you know, how much money do I have to spend on applications? It's so, <laughs> no, um, so really, truly, you'll want to make sure, you know, a lot of schools do have app fees, some don't. We don't have an application fee. Um, you know, using the Common App, you'll have to really uh, adjust in some ways. I think you can put up to about 10 schools on the Common application, um, and then you may be stuck just filling out a number of other individual school applications. I, I mean, a good number that I would say all students should at least find their way to would be at least five schools on their list. Um, I know everybody's like, nope, I know where I'm going. I'm, I'm putting this one school on, but my parents made me put a, a second just in case. But um, I would say, you know, give yourself a good handful of schools um, to really do the research on and narrow down uh, because you'll want to find the right fit at some point in this process. So uh, five would be good. I've had stories of 20 plus schools being applied to. Ooh, that seems like a lot to manage. Yes, that is a <laughs> lot, a lot to manage. A lot of things to keep track of on the requirement side too. All right, well as we, each week we try to break down kind of one part of this and so for, I think for the application you would agree that they just have to start. Mm -hmm. Get get started, fill out those applications, start getting them turned in. Um, thank you all for joining us on College Chat. We look forward to reading your applications soon. Thank you.